Sorry about that, y'all. Uh, total pandemonium. <laughs> the thing dropped. Anyways, like I was getting ready to say, so now I think this is going to have to be like part two of the first video because I don't know how to merge it all together to continue on. So, sorry, there's a part one and a part two. I believe that's how it's going to have to go. But anyways, like I was saying, I was on the first part of the video, I was saying that the tag sale was very successful. It's a lot of work. Don't think it isn't. To bring it in and bringing it out of the stuff, but I feel like it was worth it. Like I said, all three days, we really made a good profit. I was super happy with that. I met all kinds of people that came up, but let me tell you something else I did that that, um, was pretty unique. I don't see it a lot, but you know, I have a nine-year-old granddaughter and a three-year-old granddaughter. The three-year-old was here, but she was running around, you know, kids, three-year-olds, they run amok, <laughs> you know, but the, the nine-year-old, the day she was here, I set her up outside with some really good lemonade that I made because we wanted to teach her how to make her own money because we usually just get her anything she wants. She has an envelope, of course, and we teach her how to save money. But I wanted her to do something where she makes money. So I put the lemonade in this big thing, set her up outside with her own table. It said Josiah's Lemonade Stand. And um, she loved it. And let me tell you, she had people in her line. By the end of the first day, I believe she made $40. I think that's great. We were selling the lemonade a dollar a cup. So that's something else you can do with your kid. It teaches them the value of a dollar. We teaching her how to keep her station clean. Um, my husband talked to her about, he wants to get more into her with it, but he wants her to learn the part that, be, besides just selling what Gamma put out there and you putting it in a cup, he wants her to see how much it would have cost her to buy the products and, you know, like the lemonade, the water, everything she needed. He wants to teach her how to realize in business because she wants to be a hairdresser she wants to realize and she has to realize in business it takes you know you got to buy stuff first and then sell it and make money like it normally wouldn't just go you sit there and you make the money you you minus out the money that you spent so she probably would have had to take off six dollars off of her forty dollars but she still really learned a big lesson she worked hard she was putting ice in the cups um, people just thought it was adorable. They were buying that lemonade because they loved it. And she filled the cups up, so she worked because I did not pour not one glass of lemonade that day because I was busy. So that 40 she made on that day I thought was amazing. She was so happy about it. I'm so glad I did it. That's just a little tidbit. Josiah, you did good. Hi, Josiah. So anyways, you know, and I met some people that really are just here to try to Try to basically steal your stuff for a dollar. It could be something that cost me $80 and it was a lady trying to get it for a dollar. I was like, no, I think I have that marked pretty fair. It's only $4. Like, just give me the $4, lady. But she did not want to. No, I just give you a dollar. I just give you a dollar. <laughs> so I said, for some of the things, I said, you could give me a dollar. But some of the other stuff, I'm sorry, ma'am, you can't. So that's going to happen, which is okay, you know, but you will run across that. And I met all kinds of people that, that just were so nice, and they kept telling me how my tag sale wasn't junk. It was stuff that they really liked and needed. So, you know, um, it was just a good experience. A lot of work, but a good experience. We made money off it. That was fantastic. Um, sorry it took so long for me to get here and tell y'all about it. But anyways... Thank you for listening to my Dollar Tree haul and my tag sale experience um, and my lemonade stand experience. But I will be trying to pop in more, more frequently because I feel like I don't do the videos frequent enough. So let me know what you thought about this video, part one and part two, because I don't know how to merge it like some of y'all know how to edit and cut. Yeah, I know how to press play. <laughs> I'm sitting on the porch because it's a beautiful day. See? Ooh, look at my swing. Uh-oh, look at Look at the reef. Anyways, um, I hope you like this video. Please hit subscribe. I'm trying to get higher in the subscribers. I got over 100 friends on my Facebook, but I got 39 subscribers. That means some of y'all are not subscribing. Just support your girl. It's fun for me, but I also want to see people in the comments talking to me. That's why I do it. I want to interact. I want to talk, whether I know you or not. Let's get to know each other. So hit subscribe. Hit the bell so you'll get notified. Thank you for watching my tag sale slash Dollar Tree haul. I'll see y'all next time. Bye. Peace.